Good morning and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. My name is Leanne. Today is going to be a cleaning video, a very short cleaning video because when you live in 230 square feet, it doesn't take that long to clean, but we will take you along for that. So the first thing I like to do is open all of the windows, let everything air out. The air is crisp right now and it just feels really, really good coming into the RV. Then I like to light my candle first before I start because I feel like the smell just motivates me to get things done. So making the bed has become a lot easier since I switched over to Betty's, which is kind of like a sleeping bag. Um, you have the bottom and then the top and they just zip together really easily. It helps when you're kind of crammed in a corner like we are. It makes it really, really simple to make your bed. They also offer packages. So I got this package with the, the pillows and the blanket and I really like it. As you can see, straightening up does not take a lot of time. Only a couple of minutes max. One of the adjustments that I had to make was washing dishes by hand. I've had a dishwasher for a really long time, but we don't have one here. But because we have such a small space, we really don't have a lot of dishes, so it's not really a big deal to wash them by hand. The bathroom is also really tiny, so it takes me maybe two minutes to clean it. It's really easy. That is my granny sink. Robert makes fun of me, but I love that sink. And I love the fact that our RV came with a small tub because it allows Jake to still take his baths. This is by far my favorite room in the RV. I really wanted the space to be cozy and comfortable for Jake and I'm really happy with the way it turned out. Tennessee campers who did our renovation, they built this desk for him that he'll be able to use when he starts homeschooling and then put the cubbies underneath and it's just a great way to store all of his toys. I also went with Betty's in here and I would highly recommend them if you have bunk beds, even if you live in a regular house. These are such a great option because it just makes making the bed so easy and even kids can make the bed easily. I searched high and low for the best way to keep our RV floors clean and what I found was the Shark Vac Mop. Um, it vacuums and then it mops. It's not really supposed to be used on carpet but our rug is really thin and it works pretty well on that and then once you're done vacuuming you can just turn on the mop and it works really really well. So that is it. That is my cleaning video. I told you guys it would be really short thank you so much for watching. Please consider subscribing if you enjoy content like this and we will see you next time.